Good morning, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stock Swish. I thought I would take a quick look at the market here this morning, first day of the trading year, and guess what? We're gapping up. So not surprised here. We actually did make brand new all-time highs in the SPY and the Dow in the pre-market the last day of trading last week. And we're gapping up this morning. So, I mean, really looks nice for the market. Don't know what the volume's going to be this week, though, because people are still off for the week. Yesterday was New Year's. Uh, looks like we open here to 67.84. Closed. Yeah, so we opened up a buck. So we'll see what the market does. But I do believe that we have a bullish year in 2018. We'll see where we go and how quickly we go again higher. I mean, to be honest with you, I don't buy support. That's not the way that I trade. I look at gaps, bullish gaps and bearish gaps, but many people do look at support as places to buy. And, you know, the SPY support here is right on the 8 period moving average, which is the black line, and the 20 period moving average, which is the blue line. I mean, if you were looking to buy support in a pullback, you could buy the market here today. Again, I look at bullish gaps and the market is gapping up. I wouldn't say this is a place to be aggressive to go long in a bullish gap, but it's something to watch. And if we fall and break, um, yesterday's low i'm not sure where we go from there yesterday meaning the last day of trading which was last week uh even if the market pulled all the way back and I, i'm just looking at the spy here into this area here if we don't hold today if we don't hold the support even if we pull all the way back in here that would not be that big of a deal for the market still would be showing tons and tons of strength and this green line here is the 50 period moving average let's quickly take a look at everything else so i think apple pulled the cues down last week and the Dow looks higher. Let's see Apple today. Maybe it takes a little longer. Yeah, Apple definitely pulled the market down last week. In the queues. So we'll just wait and see. So focusing on SPY right now and seeing where we go here, this is one of the stronger of the indices of any of the ones I'm watching and prefer to watch this right now. We'll see where we go. Good luck everyone if you trade this week. Again, low volume. Market could make a move. I'm going to be watching it in between resting this week on the week off and being on TV. Have a wonderful week everyone trading.